Greetings gamers, today we are playing Wildermyth, and the setting we're on here is three chapters. Today's video is sponsored by Wildermyth, and we're playing Wildermyth, so it works out nicely. There's a link in the description below if you enjoy this game and you want to check it out for yourself. I highly recommend checking it out, uh, so do be sure and do that, and let's get into the game. I've got my three characters here. I've got uh, this guy, uh, Haven. He's a future warrior and a poetical greed wagon. I don't really know what that means, but he looks like Shaggy. I just want to travel around in a van and solve mysteries. He's got the green, he's got the beard, goatee thing. Yeah, that's Shaggy. Let's do it for some Scooby Snacks. Uh, the rest of the gang does not look like Scooby-Doo characters. We got a future hunter over here. She's a redhead. She's a compassionate romantic. And then a future mystic. Uh, aloof romantic. Uh, so yeah, those are the characters. Uh, I think I'm good with these. I don't want to randomize any of these. So we should be good. Let's get out there. All right, let's see what we got. Okay, Stony Candle woke to the red song of chaos. Voices bent by fear and rage. Panic, pain, flames. It's an attack. Evil is at hand. Uh-oh, not evil. Who would attack a peaceful village? Bad guys, that's who. That thing. With dragonly howls, it harries its fleeing victims, spreading death and flames here to dismantle all human creation. Well, that sounds bad. They're just jumping us right in with that monster, huh? I know you won't maybe understand this, but we're getting our calling now. Grab your weapon, Haven. My weapon? Oh, I think I want that pitchfork. Well, having reach is good. I'm no monster hugger. Here, the obvious pick. Haha, <laughs> pickaxe, obvious pick. I'm pretty sure we'll be hungry afterwards, so... Frying pan... Uh, I think we're gonna go with the pitchfork. Pitchfork seems like the best weapon. Yeah, let's get in there! What danger demands? Constructing mission. Set up that board! Heroes plus one armor warding. Oh, that's a good modifier. Foe cards. The Thrixel Dweaver. Its head weaves in odd patterns. Eyes shine like moons. Hissing suddenly, it looms to strike. All right. So this is a turn-based, uh, hand-drawn, tactical, like, RPG thing we got going on here. Where is the monster, though? I don't see it. Oh, no. It's, it's here somewhere. We can move up even more. We can attack the scenery. We can swap weapon. Uh, I don't think attacking scenery is going to do me much good. Oh, there it is. It's in the house. Guys, it's in the house. She's got a bow and arrow, so she, this is my ranged character. One of my ranged characters, I guess. We're gonna get right over here. I think I can kind of, yeah, twist it so I can see. Can she get within shooting range? I don't know. Oh yeah, they get they get bonuses for being together. I do know that. Oh no, oh, oh I switched to another character. Oh yeah, maybe I shouldn't have done that. All right, I guess we'll just wall up here and we'll kind of get in formation. Oh god, one damage. Okay, good, but we blocked. Yeah, let's get right in this dude's face. Charge, Shaggy! Here come the Snoo Scooby Snacks. Yeah, get some of that! Three damage! And some of this. Two damage! Oh yeah, we're just doing it. And we'll move up and attack. Boom! Oh, they took cover. Well, good for you. Oh, okay, you shredded my armor? But aside from that, you did nothing. I'm gonna crush you. Nope. Never mind. I could go inside and shoot at it. Yeah, let's do that. That's a flank, right? This count as a flank? This feels like 90 degrees. Two damage blocked. Alright, let's get in there. Oh, I can't. Oh, wait. I see. It takes up two spaces. So I gotta go this way. Get some of that. Oh, blocked. Man, this thing's blocking. Quite a lot of my shots. All right. Charge! Take that! Oh, get it! Shaggy for the win! You would have gotten away with it if it weren't for us meddling kids. <laughs> All right, cool. Let's get, uh... Heaven is now a Greenhorn Warrior. Let's get something. Uh, Zealous Leap is an option. Every other turn, as a swift action, Heaven makes a daring leap up to three spaces. Shield Bear, once every other turn, as a swift action, Heaven shreds two of a foe's armor with his weapon. 
When Having gets a kill, the next attack against him within one turn will miss. I think I want this leap, right? No, you know what? This is a frontline dude. So we want shield shear because it's a swift action. So I'm pretty sure I can use it and then uh, still attack. So we got ambush over here. A ranged attack on the first enemy who enters the threatened tile. Piercing shots. Lillian's ranged attacks have one pierce. Ember arrow. When standing by a blaze. Oh, she can... She can start fires. Fires can't spread onto her. I do like setting things on fire. But how often will I really be standing by a blaze? Extra two damage on that piercing attack. That sounds really good. Okay. Uh, we've got Harith over here with compulsion. She briefly interfuses with an enemy and forces it to move where she pleases. This elementalist one. Fire does not burn out when interfused. Wood splinters or liquid into infernal rain let's yeah I, ignite sounds okay but let's do elementalist feather steel scarf more speed yeah let's give it to Harith. I like it battle ends they did what danger demanded Lillian heaven and Harith are left standing sweet the fires don't swallow the town. They're fought down to cinders and buried. The folks of Stony Candle will have a trying time salvaging whole ruined lanes, squeezing people under crowded roofs. They'll manage much better than they expect, though. Haven and I agree. We're not going to let that be it. At least I'm heading out there. I don't want to be stuck fighting like that again. Surprised, caught in the middle of all that. There's a score to settle anyway, in my mind. Everything seems a lot more tenuous than it did yesterday. Yeah! The Thrixel that attacked their homes had mostly moved on by the time any defenses defense was roused. It means they can easily return, them or others, perhaps more and fiercer, with a deadlier will. Let's go be we who have to be, right? Every company of heroes is called by at least one name. A name spoken or spelled in tradition and handed along ever after. These heroes will be known as... Astelia's Thrushes, Astelia's Freedom, the Eagles of Rage, or the Chainsaw Rabbits. Yeah, that sounds better. <laughs> These are the stories of Chainsaw Rabbits. Be remembered. Oh, we will. Oh, we can, and we will. Let's go scout this area. Let's go scout it up. What do we got? Bad guys? Good guys, treasure. Full otter maples has been revealed. We got baddies. Let's get them. Let's go! Some kind of basement over here. They've been late all day. Late rising, late on the trail, late to recognize sunset, and late spotting this ruin. It's the remains of a smallish structure, splayed and molding in a starlit clearing. Lillian, are you coming down? Not a lot to see here, is there? We're the first down here in some time. Someone worked at this table. Knife lines. Stains of sediment. Ash on the floor? It's chalk. What are these hash marks? And what's in this box? What's in the box? Remember, there's that verse in Opal Night, when Spear comes to the Umber Lady's Hall. Past the open portal, shadows packed like ravens plumed. Dimming all discovery, sharply dark and darkness doomed. Spira's spark like shimmered spent, snuffed, dispelled, left all in gloom. Ooh, nice. This place isn't like that, I guess. But nowhere's poem perfect. All my youth was spent wondering what Spira Yona looked like. And if she... The box is puzzle locked! Hmm? One of those magic puzzle locks. Oh, is it words or numbers? Words. Thank all gods. He's bad at math. Remind me how these function. Enchantment, old one. Don't think anyone does it this, these days. Lock words, they called them. The words or phrases that had spring the box open. The magic lock presents a prompt with a clear slate to write an answer. The wise wanderer finds a home where... I bet there's naughty drawings in there. Hmm. Well, air's turning out better than I thought. Could cook a dinner and make a night of it. Chalk some guesses? Want to help me? Me? Sure. 
They haul their gear down the slippery stairs. Harith investigates the blocked chimney pipe, goes above ground a while and clears it from that end. Lillian takes mild interest in a few of the old books lying around. They chronicle local heroes and harvests. Haven toils over an all right stew, not sparing the seasoning much thought. They shout and scribble guesses in the meantime. Who comes up with the correct lock words? The wise wanderer finds a home where... Where his debts can't chase him? Where another wanderer would stay? Where wandering eyes are welcome. Um, I don't know. These all sound good. All right, we opened it. Let's see what we get. That's really weird. That was really it? Just then, a clatter of sleek, buggy legs echoes into the basement's hollow. Must have heard our treasure box open. Oh, Harith, what's in my box? <laughs> uh, looks like some odds and ends. Might be something worthwhile. Of course there is. It's my box. <laughs> That's weird. I got a gloom glass bracelet. Stunt chance six. A pair of bracers studded with colored stones. Uh. Okay, let's give it to Lillian. All right, we got it. Oh my goodness, we got a Thrixel Dweaver. We already fought one of those. We got a Thrixel Thrusk. Clambering and clattering, it cries out in doubled voices. Oh, two Thrixel Thrux Thrusks. Okay, this could get dicey. Let's get spicy. I don't see anybody. I'm guessing that whatever is going to attack us is going to attack us from behind this door. So let's move up. Advance, my loyal soldiers. Open the door. There she blows. Okay, we got baddies. So I think the strat here is going to be, oh my, oh my god. Okay. Oh, oh wait, oh we can shield cheer. But that will end the turn. How much armor do I think these guys have? Yeah, I guess let's try shield cheer. Okay, your armor is shredded. Now we will attack you. I can interfuse too, but... Oh, nice damage on the armor shredded enemy. Oh no, it dodged. That could get bad for us. Oh, whoa, okay, that thing just moved right around me. It flanked me. That's bad, that's bad. We've been flanked hard. Okay, we gotta finish this one off, is the first thing that we must do. Can I flank it? Flank it and spank it? I'm gonna try and flank it. Flank attack! Yeah, now what? Four damage! That's what. All right, I'm gonna drop back with this character. And then I'm probably gonna try and interfuse. So what Interfuse does is it allows me to like mingle with the essence of a thing and then I get some powers based on whatever I Interfuse with. Okay, this thing has Discus, that's good. Bone Lance, four range, one, two, three, four. Okay, that thing's out of range. This thing has Discus. We'll Interfuse here and then we'll see if we can hit it. Discus, go. Oh, it's out of range. Okay, so we'll force it to drop back here to within discus range of us. Oh, whoa, no, I did not mean to do that. Dang, I put myself right in harm's way there. Boom. Okay, we got three damage. Harith might be in trouble. Nope, okay, not attacking Harith. That's good. Oh, there's that second one. Oh, my gosh. All right, we are taking damage. We need to finish this guy off as fast as possible. And I think the way we do that... It's just by moving up and wrecking him, huh? Let's go, heaven! We're having a blast. Three damage. Get it! Okay, he's down. Okay, can I discus this guy? Select a target. Nope, I guess your, your weapon range is shown in red. Oh, he's just out of range. All right. Well, if that's what's happening, then we're going to drop back. Yeah, let's drop back. And then we could just wait. Or I could try to interfuse with something else. Like this thing behind it. 
Okay, we've interfused with the loom. Okay, but that did end our turn. Yeah, let's sh let's shoot you. Get shot! Boom! Nice dodge! Okay, this thing has moved out of... It keeps moving out of range of where I want to interfuse and attack. Let's shred his armor. That would have been better to do. Oh, and I can strike. Yeah. Okay, we're going to do both. Oh, he blocked it. What a jerk. All right, we are going to move up and attack now. His armor shredded. We can get him. Boom! Three damage. Down you go. Get some of that in your life. Another sweet, sweet victory for me. Good for me. Kevin and Lillian are now rivals. What, how did we become rivals? Dusty Drab. Pretty standard set of heavy duty clothing that is functional and sturdy. Okay. Replace humble Jennings, yes. Got it, good. Your enemies improve their strategies after every fight. This monster is now stronger, plus one damage. Well, that's not good. I just don't like lingering here, all right? These places aid you. Secure the watermill. Investigate thoroughly, catalog everything, and find an item. We'll put all these heroes on it. A thorough delving through the mysteries of the Fantana Watermill prove, have proven rewarding. I was hoping for a bit more, honestly. Fantana Watermill will return to the hands of the common folk. While they tend to it, the site will provide resources at the end of each chapter. Heartwoods and fabrics. Good. And we got a Fox Quartz Ring that adds armor. So we're going to give it to Shaggy. All right. Let's go scout over here. We'll take the whole party. Oh, we got a... We got an extra recruit over there. We should do that. But first, let's do this fight. Let's go! Did you see the huge moth that landed in Lillian's hair earlier today? How could I not? And you weren't going to say anything? Nah. She walked around with it for like an hour. Havin thinks it's hilarious. Tell me a story before the embers die out. Hmm. I just want to spend some time in the world where everything fits together nicely. Well, what would you like to hear? Tell me the one about the trickster moon. How about the fire queen and the raindrop? Nothing too fantastic. Just tell me about something that happened to you. Fire queen and the raindrop. That sounds more exciting. Havin described a bitter sorceress who ruled her realm with a fiery hand. One day, a raindrop fell onto her plate and told her of the suffering her axe had caused. Go on, little teardrop, she laughed and puffed a warm wind to dry it right up. But another raindrop fell on her table this time. This one, she shriveled with a flick of her fingernail, but still more fell. The sorceress began shooting gouts of flame and screaming the heat from the earth, but it wasn't enough. The rain fell with one voice, rising, rising, and eventually the flame queen and all her ashery were washed away in a great torrent. And the raindrops all lived happily ever after? as those in inspiring tales tend to. You asked for a story, you got a story, all right? Having gained temporary potency, Hearth gained temporary warding. We got Woken Slingers. They're so woke. <laughs> Loading a sling and swinging it around, panic rises in slack face until the stone flies. And then Woken Fighters, a shuffling walk, gummy grunting mouth, a heavy sword held firm. All right, let's get him. Hey, we got a leaf spirit. Go, leaf spirit. Is that good? Go up here. Let's open the door. What do we got? I don't know. I want to move up and support this leaf spirit. I don't know what it's doing, but I want it on my team. Caught! Caught you! Do I get to make a wish now? Oh, I didn't know I could catch it. Mur? Enchant sword or get a legacy point. Sure. I could use a sword. Aha! Ebon Mark of Deepkins! Yay! Neato. I'll take it. Boop, bop, beep, bop. Ah, here we go. I do wonder what's behind that door. But over here in this room, there might be treasure or something. Let's explore this room first. Mm, no treasure. They'll never expect us to attack from this angle, guys. We've got this. Open door. 
There's nothing in here. An empty room. Oh, a sh wait, a shrine. I, I mean, I could attack the scenery. Hello? Alright, we crushed that scenery, but that didn't really do anything for us. And attack these mushrooms. Die, mushrooms. I thought maybe they would give me some health or something. But so, nothing really in there. I bet you our real enemy is in here. Let's open this door and see what we're up against. There's the monsters. We'll go into guardian mode. We'll attack anything that comes near us. Let's interfuse with this bookshelf. We've revealed another thing. We can bone lance th this guy. Bone lance him. Bone lance this Woken. Get bone lanced. You got attacked from behind by a bookshelf. That can't feel good. All right. And let's just try and take this guy down. Three damage. You're dead. Oh, wow. That guy's running. Oh, I see what you're doing. He did two damage to me and made me move. Well, I don't like that he made me move. All right. Let's get in cover behind this thing. And we will once again go into guardian mode. Uh, here we will once again bone lance our enemies. Get bone lanced. Dodged. Well, I don't agree with that. I think I can att- Oh, oh wait, the thing exploded. Uh, let's shoot this guy. Boom, take three damage. Oh, wow, but I took three damage back. Oh, wow, we're taking a lot of damage. Okay, we gotta get out of there. But first off, we gotta charge with this guy. No, we gotta charge over here. And do some serious damage. Strike! Dodged. I hate that. I'm gonna retreat with this character. We could probably move up, interfuse, and then do something with those barrels. She's at full health, yeah, she's fine. Or set someone on fire. And the and the thing's on fire, so yeah, let's do that. Steal fire. Let's drop the fire right on this tile. Get on fire! Wow, you're dead. You have burned to death. Although the fire might spread to my character. Okay, so we are going to silk step to a space. And let's make that space back here. We're now hidden. You just got blocked. You're about to be in a world of hurt. Because I've got shield cheer. Get some of this. Yeah, your armor shredded. Oh, five damage to your face. Shield cheer is great. I love it. What an ability. I love it. Choose a new ability. Heaven reduces the cost of recruit jobs by one, plus five stunt to all heroes in the party. I still don't understand what stunt is. Vigilance. Heaven's heightened senses allow him to perform up to two reaction strikes per turn. Once per combat, grant an adjacent target four temp health and remove negative status effects. That sounds great. Only once per combat though, but having a heal in combat is great. Igneous knee pad. Bonus damage 0.7. Let's give it to Lillian. Your enemies improve their strategies after every fight. Hobble enemy. This monster is now stronger. Successful attacks hobble the target. Well, I don't like that they're getting stronger. Boo. All right. Let's uh, let's make a full search. Before, be sure we don't leave anything valuable. Research complete. A thorough delving through the mysteries of Macian's vigil has proven rewarding. Since I found something, doesn't doesn't it seem like it should go to me? Macian's vigil will return to the hands of the common folk. While they tend it, the site will provide resources at the end of each chapter. Hides, ingots, spell threads. Strap of attunement, a braided cord onto which you could tuck all manner of lucky charms. There we go. Boom. I do want to recruit from over here. Yeah, I guess I need to go with everyone. All right, new recruits. Cool. It didn't take long to trek back to Stony Candle and the town still seemed like the best bet for finding another able pair of hands. Who'd I get? Wait, it's you from the heroes. We are heroes. The, right, anyway, I was hoping you'd come back. I get that a lot. Everything all right? 
Oh, everything's fine, and that's just it. It's been quiet in Stony Candle so far, but I heard those things you said. That talk of glory and victory, and I'm sure someone mentioned treasure at some point. And it struck me more than I would have thought. Is that how we put it? Possibly. Forming a company of heroes can get one a little fired up. You were right, though. With the biggest risks come the biggest rewards, and I feel ready for a risk bigger than which field should the turnips go in this year. Well, we could use another fighter on our side, if you're game. Oh, fantastic. I'm glad you offered. And I can see you have excellent judgment in recruiting, so that's a big plus. Far be it from us to turn you down, then. Train as a warrior, train as a hunter, or train as a mystic. Probably another warrior, probably another frontliner, huh? Wara the warrior, her name's Wara. Wara the warrior, warrior just makes sense. Let's go scouting. Where's my new character? Are they still training? Oh, I see, prepare recruit is going. Uh, your enemies advance the plan over time. Okay, we shouldn't, yeah, we're wasting way too much time. All right, yeah, we can't wait for you guy. We need to send my heroes. To a new area. A scar in the prairie widens into a misty veil, and Lillian finds herself exploring a marshy little woodland. Dragonflies garble the air with wings and whirs. Swamp Witch. That's who I'd expect to see here. Some mysterious woman in a wide hat. Mist that weaves around her, and eyes that flash like coins inside a well. You have indulgent eyes. Make a dangerous gambler. Whoop. Hmm? Thought I'd met a swamp witch suddenly. And who's to say you haven't? My name's Qualnar Tretlo. There are some here that call me Lucky Qualnor, or the Gold Shadow Man. Some just call me the Gambler. Wow, I'd love to work out a name train like that one. Oh, it gets exhausting sometimes. Sometimes I like going unknown. Unknown and unmeasured. In any case, I should give a good greeting to you. Out of the way place to meet a traveler. Out of the way, apparently not ours. I'm on the home path myself, but here I can crown a moment like this. Qualnor produces a small box, banded in bright brass. Behold! He sets it on a stone. A chance meeting reminds us that chances are fleeting. Here's a little betting box. How about two strangers wager together in the wet marsh? The game is guessing what's inside, and your word is your wager. You'll pay what you say. Oh no, I'm terrible at guessing games. I'd guess something worn, a trinket, trinket. in a box, maybe some precious, precious materials. The essence of life itself. This looks like it has a 70% chance to succeed, so let's go with that. A trinket, you say? Or, uh, some more an article. Like my igneous knee pad here. Open it, then. Flicks the lid open, and spies the small treasure treasure nestled inside. Truly an extraordinary guess. I get these twinges, these sparks of knowing. Sure you want to part with it? You wagered and won. That's rules. Also, it wasn't something I cherished. Won it in Iron Dwell off a burly bellmaker, betting whether someone in the tavern could recite a certain old poem. Hey, what's your name? Did you say it? Lillian, what's the poem? I don't know, and no one else did either. Fare you well, Lillian. May fortunes find us on a drinking bench someday. Strap of Faith. Okay, Lillian has an empty slot. She'll take it. We gotta build this up. Build a spation, station, spend one legacy point. A hide and fabric, that seems the most balanced. Or we could get two fabrics or two hides. This seems the most balanced, let's do it this way. Got it, outfitter established. Oh, Wara needs help getting her gear ready. Oh, I have to be over there to train recruits. Whoops, well, we just took some time getting over there, but that's okay. Finish training that recruit. I thought we could just leave her to train. Recruit prepared. What do we want? Wolf call. Let's try this vigilance. We already have someone who can do shield cheer. And let's go scout this area. With the full party, we got four now. We got a, we got four, no, I guess not a full party, but we got four. I feel good about this. North Thistle Stand has been revealed. Let's get them. Let's go, team. Is that Wara up there? Yeah, it looks like she's coming back. Hey, just like Harith said, Emberberry is just over the hill there. Time for a few pints and a hot meal. This is a waste of time. We still have a few hours of daylight. We should press on. Ah, we've been traveling a lot lately. We could all use the break. Tomorrow we fight, but tonight we drink. Come on, I'm buying the first round. Woohoo! You all go on ahead of, without me. I don't feel like pubbing it tonight. Loser. You know what? I'll catch up to you later. 
Oh wait, no, two of them left. Hey, how about you help me with that leg sweep move? What's wrong with you? Maybe I should give her some space. Let's try the leg sweep move. You mean the sweeping swallow? Oh, it's not called the drop down spinny leg sweep thing? I spent a fair amount of time perfecting it. The least you could do is get the name right. Weeping Willow, got it. You don't have to stay just to keep me company. Hey now, nailing this move could save my life someday. That it could, and practicing can't hurt, especially given how bad you were the last time you tried. Ah, they're friends now. Constructing mission, I'll set up a board for you. Harith and Lillian, flanking attacks this combat deal plus one damage. Oh man, these enemies have extra damage and extra health. That seems bad, but we have an extra hero, so. I'm sure we'll be okay, maybe. All right, let's go into guardian mode. He will also go into guardian mode. We'll force them to make the first move. And we'll also try to interfuse with something in that room. Like that. Like these knives! And we'll probably barrage. Oh, let's say this thing. With knives! Four damage. Did we just take that thing out instantly? Dang, we are good. Okay, it looks like we can move up here and actually have an attack on this guy. Oh, we're off to a great start. I love this. I love what's happening. Now walk right into our guardian attack. Wait. We were in guardian mode. How are they attacking without getting counterattack? Oh, and they've interfused something over there. Well, that could get bad. Oh, because these guys attacked at range? Is that why guardian didn't go off? Well, whatever. We're going to move up and attack. Get strikes. Boom! Four damage. Wow, that was great. What an attack. Five damage. Dang, we're good. All right. Here's the thing, I don't trust whatever this is. So I'm gonna have to break it. Yeah. That's what you get, trying to interfuse things behind me. I don't roll like that, son. And you, get shot! Boom, three damage to your face. Okay, you shredded my armor and you've attacked me for one damage. Ha! <laughs> one pathetic damage. All right, we're gonna move up and attack. Let's show him. Oh wait, we shouldn't have done it this way. Can I switch characters? Yeah, she still has a move left. Let's shred armor first. Armor shredded. Now we strike. Yeah, you're dead. Let's go into guardian here, just in case. And. We'll move up here. Can I interfuse with anything? Yep. We got a display case back here. Prepare to suffer the wrath of my display case. Display case. Bone Lance this guy. Boom! Take two damage. Five damage. Wow. We're really doing it, guys. Okay. Get shot. Boom! Uh, I think we can finish this. Oh, okay, yeah, I see. He reacted. Oh, but I reacted back! Boom! Another sweet, sweet victory with my new four-person party. And we got some throwing knives! Harris's hands are full. This guy could throw some knives. He doesn't have any... Actually, neither one of these two have any ranged abilities. Let's give it to Wara. Offhand throwing knife, I like it. Okay, they got more health. Yeah, these monsters are getting powerful. I'm a little worried. All right, guys, and this is where we're gonna leave it. If you wanna see more of this game, this game is called Wildermyth. Uh, do check the description below uh, because there'll be a link to the game where you could pick it up and play for yourself. I highly recommend it, I'm having a lot of fun. And big thanks to Wildermyth for sponsoring this video.